here she is again, my new shop assistant. What? There you go. Just lay down there and be quiet. Yeah, well, you got half of it right. Just be quiet. Okay? Well, you're going to run like hell when I start the router up, aren't you? kiddos. Good morning. Um, it's time to do the deed. Um, I've got my soundboard taped off. Uh, I've got my rosette circles redrawn. So now we're just going to drill a hole um, so that we can uh, uh, mount it on my routing board. Uh, and then we'll tape it and then we'll Route it. Let the pucker factor begin. All right, here we go. I'm starting from the fingerboard edge of uh, this rosette circle because if I bobble anything it's probably going to be up here and then the fingerboard will cover it up. We got her done with the Dremel. Um, my channel is not 100% level because this is a hand thickness um, soundboard. Um, and in typical rattle can fashion, I when I went to move my router, because I'm taking that fly that fly almost killed me. Um, when I went to move my uh, router, because I'm taking little bitty bites out of this, I took one, two, three, four, I took five passes um, to make this cross. And um, in my eagerness, I went the wrong way. 
because, <laughs> you know, anyways. So, we got two options, and I mean they're fine. This is not the disaster that it certainly could have been. Um, I still need to hand, I still need to use this on the, uh, on the edge and just peel a little tiny bit away, and I mean a little tiny bit away, um, to get this to drop down uh, in there. Uh, and then, um, then what I'm going to do is, um, um, we may end up just using one strip of the perfect strips on the outside, and then maybe two or three on the inside. Um, to make up that difference, but we can't. I don't really know until I get this channel um, dug out a little bit better. So uh, let's see if you can. Uh, it is. This side is a little. This is, is deep over here. So all right. Let me let's get this thing set up and do some more cutting. Ain't no better train wreck than the train wreck you're driving. We are talking teeny, teeny, tiny cuts here. Now on this one, I am striving To cut in the appropriate directions because this is a just a solid piece of wood not the plywood that I've been practicing with Let's get the nice chisel. Nice chisel? It's Japanese chisel. This is the one really nice chisel I own. I gotta move, I gotta stand right there, so, so sorry.
this morning. Just like that. <sighs> yeah, maybe got a little too much on this one. Terrifying. This is... <laughs> on the outside and then we'll fill in with three or four more however many we have to all right now it's just getting this cleaned up <laughs> 